Ready? Okay. okay. I did it. Slime! Underwater. So we have been seeing the Coke and Mentos challenge where they actually put it in a fish bowl. Oh yeah, fish tank. Fish tank. Okay. But we're gonna try some other things first. Um, I love the layering liquids and we're gonna be, put a twist on that as well. So first we're gonna start with some slime making. <laughs> Oh my gosh, slime making. Crazy. I mean, really. really. Yeah, crazy. Huh. All right, so we're going to start with a glue. So before we start putting our glue in here, this is only like a half of one that I didn't want to waste and throw it away because it's so butamous. Um, and if y'all don't know, this is the real Willet Slime. He created the channel. This is Adam. I see in the comments all the time, where's the guy who used to do the channel? <gasps> here he is. I'm here. Adam's here. He's I'm back, here. guys. Oh and my gosh. It is like, uh, I don't know how, much, how hot it is out here today, but. It is, uh, it says it's 101 degrees. 101, oh wait a minute, wait a minute. I looked, at that, I looked at that backwards. It's not 101, it's, uh, oh, it's 101. Wow, okay, so let's get with this. Um, we're going to put our glue in our bowl. I'm gonna put a little bit of water with this to try to get the rest of it out. Okay, I'm just gonna stick the finger in it. Go ahead, go ahead, clog it with your finger. Yeah, save time, okay. All right, so we're gonna get our slime started here. Excuse me, we're trying to do a video here. Please stop blowing your horn. <laughs> so rude. Mix that up, and then we need some activator. I'm using this beautiful Elmer's magical liquid. Magical. It's magical. It's, it's magical. Magic. Make our slime. I just love that. It's so pretty. Ooh, that it's is heavy. that is some lovely slime. That is okay. beautiful. So I think that's the perfect consistency for what we want to do with this. It looks just like snot. All right. It's not. It's not. It's not snot. It's not snot. It's not. All right, so here is our glass. And we're going to take a little bit of this slime. And I'm going to put it in the bottom. And I want to see what happens when I layer it with other liquids. And now, in no particular order, I'm just going to start putting stuff in here randomly and hope for the best. See what happens. So this is some extra virgin olive oil. And I'm gonna put in some of this uh, dish detergent. I'm actually gonna color this because you can't see it and hopefully it doesn't mix together, then it just you'll never see it. And I'm gonna make it pink, hopefully. Maybe to mix itself. Yeah. Oh, the slime's already coming up. Look, 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 look. It really didn't make a pretty pink vinegar. I actually like the smell of vinegar. You like the smell of vinegar? <clears throat> vinegar? <clears throat> no. <laughs> no. I do. Mm. I don't know if you see it. Ooh! Okay, this should separate. But there's slime already popping up. I don't know if you can see that. There's slime right there. It's blue very cool. This is very gross. It's gonna separate. It's gonna be pretty. Okay, so I wanted to do some just just regular water and I want to make it a pretty color. Let me see here. What have we got? Purple. Okay. I can actually still drink this water. Look at that. Woo, look at that. That's so pretty. So pretty. Oh, the sun went it's down. So, That's woo. great. That's much better. <laughs> I was back there. There's uh, a cloud over it temporarily. Feels good. Okay. All right, so we're gonna do purple. I may have ruined it. I don't know if you can tell, I'm gonna turn this towards that. You can see there's like a little volcano action going right there that's going up like the, what do you call them? Those cool slimes? They're avalanche. Not, avalanche slime. It's cool. kind of doing that. I'm gonna put some honey here and we're gonna call it a day. Oh. And we're gonna come back and see, is it still nasty or did it separate? Because I know this does work, it just takes some time. I don't think it's going to separate. Well, I hope it does. I don't think it's going to separate. They're supposed to. I've done it before, but I didn't write down the in instructions this time. Um, yeah. But now it's kind of like this deep red with orange on top and some sparkles on the bottom. So we'll come back. So now we're going to make which, what I call a coat geyser. I don't know if that's the proper word. Is that what they call it? 
Mm, I don't know. Mentos Coke geyser? I don't know. Mentos and Coke. We're just going to do that. So. Oh, we're going to find out which one works better. We're going to try mint Mentos versus... Fruit Mentos. Ooh, that was not very enthusiastic. The way Fruit! You said that. Fruit Mentos. <laughs> no. The Fresh Maker. And I've got my handy uh, dandy Mentos whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, dispenser. Uh, uh, wait, is that my curtain rod? So first thing is, I'm going to open up my Coke. I'm just going to drop my Mentos down inside. One. I think I think this may be a little bit of overkill, but okay. So I'm going to put a little card over this. So three, two, one, blast off. Out. Oh wow, we just didn't see it. Wow. That is too cool. Okay, let's ah! let's go for bottle number two. <laughs> bottle number two. Okay. Are there you gonna go. do this one or am I doing yeah, this one? Uh, um, I wanna try it. Okay, you do this one. I'm like getting coke shower over here on my feet. Okay, yeah, you, you stand over there. Okay. So oh they're so pretty. Okay. The pink ones are my favorite. Can I eat that one? But I can have the orange one. Oh yeah, I got four. Okay. Well, that, now it's not a fair competition. That's okay. Like four of these dropped out. Four okay. of these dropped out. Oh. Okay. Mentos are delicious. This is not an ad for Mentos, by the way. I just love Mentos. Mm -hmm. Ready? And go. Mine was amazing. That was awesome. Um, that was weird. Mine was much better. The, the fruit Mentos did, did twice as big. Should we try it again? Or? I think it's because I did it. Should we try that again or should we move on? Try it again. Try it again? Yep. Fresh Gosh, bottle. You scare me with that. All right, guys, since mine was the successful one, I'm going to see about this one and see if it was just me or is the fruit flavored Mentos better than the mint for these geysers. It does taste better. Three, two, one, go. They're not coming out. them in here all right want want we may never know yes okay moving on okay guys so for the next experiment we have a fish tank here that we are going to do something cool with that I don't know what but Kim's gonna explain first we're going to add water to our tank Okay guys, so our aquarium is filled to the top and we are actually going to make the largest slime, nuggly slime, underwater. So we're going to open up these packs of glue. That's not glue. Packs of bubble gum, classic bubble, I, I don't know, some gum. It's edible gum. But you're not going to want to- It's wanna... edible slime. <laughs> but you're not going to want to- eat this because it's in a tank full of water from they, they, the hose. They can't eat it anyway. Oh, that's true. Don't, don't, yeah. don't worry about it. Uh, yeah. Doesn't relate to you. <laughs> so we've made this recipe before and I love it. It's so the I just throw easiest. Them in? Do I just throw them in now? I don't think so. I don't think we'd be able to get them out. I don't throw 
No, no, we need to we open. open these. We open all of these. Oh, well, we're gonna throw that one in. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just gonna put gum in there. Let's see what, what happens. Oh, it does not float. Gum do, does not float. Gum does not float. <laughs> does not float. <laughs> this is gonna take forever. Forever. Let's speed this portion up. All right. So we're just gonna take this. Oh, it's coming together already. It's it's like it's hard to describe the feeling. It's almost like um. <laughs> Chewing gum. That you take out of your mouth. I feel like this might go faster if I just put this in my mouth and chewed it. I dare you. No, I'm good. I dare you. I'm good. You dare me? Good. You dare me? <gasps> oh my gosh, so we just bought this from the uh, animal store. What do you call it? A pet store. And it had debris, and it had not been cleaned. I mean, it was right off the shelf, and he just ate it all. Dust, probably some dead bugs. Okay, guys. Slime, underwater, no glue style. Yay. Yeah. It's slime. Yay. It's... We did it. Okay, next. And now we're gonna try some of these confetti cannons and see what happens. I've got slow motion camera back here, which hopefully is working and we'll try to get it. But it is so hot out here that I've just, I got to. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> oh. Thank you. That's so much better. Shake, I'll, go shake, shake. I'll go first, I'll okay. go first. I'll watch you. Three, two, one. It's doing nothing. I didn't make it in the water. I don't know what I did. I did it. That was just a smidge more powerful than I was expecting. That's like a firecracker. Ooh, that was loud. Oh, look at all these though. They're so pretty. It's so beautiful. It's real. <laughs> Moving on. So now we're going to play a game called What's In It? What's Inside? What's Inside? I knew that was wrong. I mean, what's right. in it? It could work either way. Underwater stuff. <laughs> what's in the balloon? Right. Wait, we should point out that our neighbor, if you hear a lawnmower in the background, he's mowing his grass for the first time in six or eight months and he chose now to do it. So yay! Yay for him. Enjoy the background sounds. Okay. Okay, so, I'm so excited. Let's see how this goes. I'm so excited. He's so excited. Oh, and by the way, if you want to know any of the science behind any of this stuff, Google it. Because <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Okay, go. Go low, go low, go low. Oh! It popped on me. I did not even cut it. Scared me so bad. It's the public pool, everybody. Yeah. It's the kiddie pool. What's inside? You're just dying to know what's inside. What's inside? I'm scared. Ooh. Ew. That was a big old bubble. It was glitter. <laughs> glitter. It was glitter. glitter. It was glitter. It was totally glitter. Totally glitter, everybody. There you see it. That's really pretty. Okay, so in the background you may hear, well, you may hear traffic, you may hear lawnmowers, but you may also hear Kim and the girls opening up one million Mentos. I'm lying, they're opening up a little over a thousand Mentos. And we're gonna put them in these Cokes. And we're gonna put the Cokes in this uh, aquarium because that's what we've seen other people do and that's how YouTube works, okay? So that's what we're doing. We're gonna test it and find out what happens. So first I gotta get these Cokes into the aquarium and then we're gonna get a giant straw and drink all the coke See how long these Coke bottles take to empty? I do know a little bit of science, just a smidge. I can show you, if you wanna open, if you wanna clean your 
You want to clear? You want to clear out a bottle? You want to clear out a bottle really quick? Here's how you do it. Take your bottle, turn it upside down, and make it into a cyclone. And let's see what I did there was I did a cyclone and then I did it the other way. Let me just do it one way this time, and we'll see how this works. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. How fast can I empty it? How fast? You ready? I want you to time this for me. One, two, ready, go. I don't know if it's any faster, but it's cooler. It's a party, everybody. Looks like a bazooka. Yeah, that's that's way faster than the whirlpool hurricane method I was using. <laughs> Much. Kim's Kim's over there looking at me crazy. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Right out of the cannons! Sun has gone down a little bit, but I am still thirsty. That's good. That's good stuff. <coughs> okay, so we have unwrapped like a thousand Mentos. It's insane. This is literally over a thousand. This is literally like a million dollars worth of Mentos, right? A million. A mi one, Mentos are crazy expensive yeah. and delicious. That one was on the ground. They're delicious. <laughs> okay, you ready? You ready? What's gonna happen? Let's wait, 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 wait. Let's make sure. I gotta make sure the camera's going. Okay, okay, okay. Ready? Ready? Okay. Ready? Okay. okay. Well, that stank. That literally was nothing like what I was expecting. I was. So as you can see, I'm in a fresh change of clothes because actually our lawn guy came up and started mowing the grass and we had to quit. And I didn't want to sit around nasty and coke sticky. and yeah. yeah. I went and got just a little container of oil just a, just a smidge of oil. Alright. And... Sweat. Here we go. Oh, cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. Ooh, the Coke is like going to the bottom. That is too cool. That's like underneath like the ocean. There's a, uh, what is it? A pond or a river? There's water within water. That is the weirdest thing. And that's kind of what this is simulating. Too cool. Oh, and he lost the bottle. Oh, you really didn't do that much uh, more. But look at all the fuzz. I call it fuzz, but it's fizz. Look at all that. It looks hairy. Up on like the hat. Okay. Now this is supposed to do like a little geyser thing from what we saw. Um, oh yes, it's doing it. How cool. Looky there. Oh, neato. And it smells like Coke. Amazing. <laughs>